my home is full of plant life and terrariums and I, I guess surrounding myself with it is inspiring. Um, I draw a lot of my inspiration from nature and the natural world, that growth and those systems of growth and decay and the photosynthesis and plant life but also as far as like our solar system and just the way those networks and systems function um, so precisely that the design that's within those is inspiring. Um, and I guess personally I like to think about that intricacy and um, how these small intricate um, systems work together and can function and that discovery within you know the plant life cycle and um, so I get so as an artist creating a space that has that same discovery and is referencing those systems and networks is important to me. Studying in textiles I was always really interested in interior fabrics and patterns um, and kind of the layering of information that you can get through a pattern on a te woven textile. Um, and kind of from, I started on the loom and kind of moved away from there onto a frame loom, which is actually a little bit more primitive um, because it's all weaver controlled or hand controlled um, and started weaving with wire. So then I was kind of creating these objects or planes that could be manipulated dimensionally and um, I mean this piece for example is woven with has a wire on it and then is woven with um, aluminum tin um, a found pot can that then has been transformed into something that is weavable and manipulated. Yeah, layers of information are really important to me as an artist and within my work um, for the viewer, it's really about that joy of discovery, um, being able to get up close and be captivated by this space and kind of the information and by using the layers of, um, a lot of times I'll do sandblasting on glass surfaces and then have layers of painting or have layers of found material and then have a background of another image, um, but just, um, as much as it is for the viewer to engage within the space, it's also, again, referencing kind of the complexity and the density of information within um, the natural world around us, which is always what's inspiring my work and kind of um, the base of the pieces. They're always derived from the things found in nature and the world around us, and so complexity and density of information is important to me.